Hi, everybody. Um, time has come for us to stop calling these uh, puppies by their collar colors. And um, so time to learn their names. Um, before I do that, a um, little couple of little housekeeping things. Um, you will see on all the puppies that they have their big dog collars on. So bigger splash of color. So hopefully once they get out to the garage, which will be on Monday morning now, um, then um, you'll be able to really tell which puppy it is. So, and the second thing is that I forgot to mention that they're on Yukonuba puppy chow now. So they're sort of on the, not big dog chow, they're on the puppy chow um, and we'll be on that for a year. So the no more weaning diet. And um, so they're getting to be big kids. It seems like yesterday that they were born. So since I have Miss Purple in my hands, I will introduce her. Her name is Holly. I think most of you know that. And um, she um, is a cute little girl named on Facebook. So here's Holly. At my feet is Miss Orange. And she's had on that tiger collar, by the way, those are cat collars. So the dogs are probably very happy that they now have dog collars on. And, and um, so those are quick release cat collars, which, are, which work out really well for the pups when they're smaller. But this pup is um, Miss Orange and we are now calling her Harpo. So um, I'll let her go back and have her nap. And of course, Holly is now eating my feet. So if you see me wiggling, you can imagine how sharp these teeth are at this point. So um, um, I, I have to wiggle around a lot not to be bitten. So here is Harpo. She says hi. Neon Green. Neon Green, our cute little girl. And her name is Harbor. So um, I'll let her go back and have her nap, but very, very sweet little girl, and her name is Harbor. So we're all gonna have to discipline ourselves to no longer say, oh, there's neon green over there. We're gonna have to memorize that her name is now Harbor. I'm sure you have noticed how this puppy certainly looks <laughs> different than the rest of them. Um, this is Harvest, named by all of you on Facebook. And Harvest, I think, certainly takes after her daddy, Zorba, who is a golden retriever. So I think probably when she grows up, she's going to, I know she'll have this long hair, but I think that um, she is, she's, She's just going to look like a full grown golden retriever. So genetics are always so interesting to see, um, to see that you could have a, a dog like um, Holly that I think is going to look very much like a, a Labrador retriever. And then you have Harvest coming out of the same litter who's going to look like a golden retriever. So there you go. And here we have Hala. Hala is Miss Brown, now known as Hala, which is the name for a very sweet dog. So um, again, Hala, I think is gonna look very much like a Labrador Retriever, a dark Labrador Retriever, but uh, here she is, Miss Hala. And Neon Pink. Neon Pink is Hudson, named after our wonderful CEO who has announced his retirement after 24 years. So named after Corey Hudson. And um, I'm, I'm very proud to have a puppy in um, our house that is named Hudson. So he's a cute boy. He's going to be sort of half fluffy and half short haired, but more towards the short haired part, as I said. The harvest certainly wins the long haired contest. Somebody must be hiding in the tube. Oh yeah. Whoa. 
the big boy of the litter, Hoagie. That's his name. Mr. Turquoise is now Hoagie, and Hoagie um, was named by our wonderful friends from Yukonuba. Um, he is going to be raised by a puppy raiser who um, works in Yukonuba. And um, he, um, Yukonuba was, the name was um, established in around the 1940s. And um, he was, uh, Yukonuba was, was uh, um, established then. And Hoagie is named after Hoagie Carmichael. Oh, there goes the foot. Um, a famous jazz player at that time. So that's our hero litter. I think I've um, sent them all to you. I'm sorry if I've missed somebody. Um, but just to review, going down the line, we have we have Holly, Harvest, Hudson, Harpo, Harbor, Hoagie, and Holla. So I hope you like the names. We all like the names. And um, so watch them grow. As I said, on Monday morning when you turn on your live cam, um, these pups will be out in the garage. So, boy, the games really begin then. They go up and down slides, and the tunnels get bigger, and they have more room to run around. So um, um, you'll enjoy it. It's, it's a fun time in the, in the life of this litter. But hard for me to believe they're going to be big dogs. So take care. Everybody enjoy the rest of your day. And... Um, We'll wave goodnight as has become our tradition at nine o'clock Pacific Standard Time. So everybody have a good day. Bye-bye.